Today I'm going to show you how to connect up Stripe to Claude so that you can send invoices, create customers all from the chat and we're going to use the Stripe MCP server. So this page will be linked somewhere on this video and I'm going to show you some of the tools which we're going to be able to access like create a price, create payment links, create new invoices and if you've never done this before it's literally going to take a few minutes to set up. So we're going to do it with Claude Desktop copy this and then we need to go and add it to this file. So all you need to do is open Claude, go to the settings. So I'm going to do command comma, developer, edit config. And then I'm going to open this file in cursor. Once you're in cursor, just paste in that code that we copied. And now we just need to edit the API key. So I'm going to go back to Stripe. And when you create a new account, you'll see a secret key here. But if you've got an active account, you'll need to go into developers because that bit doesn't show there anymore. Uh, you go to developers, API keys, and when you hover over the token on secret key, you can click to copy. We just go back to cursor. We don't want to delete this uh, character at the end. We just want to paste it like that. Save it quit cursor, I'm going to quit Claude, and then I'm going to open Claude up again. And now you can see straight away that all the MCP tools are available. There's 14 tools on here. And also to verify, we can see that under developer, this command is running. So on here, I'm going to just say, create a payment link for a hundred pounds for basic support. And you'll see it will come up and say allow. So we just need to allow for this chat. So it's created a product, it's added a price, and now it's creating a payment link. And now we can literally click that link and when this is on your real Stripe account, right now I'm just in the test mode, you can send this to a customer and get them to pay an invoice. And you've, you've generated it in like two seconds. So I think this would be really useful if you connected it to other MCP servers like Slack. And then you could say, generate an invoice for this customer and just send it straight, send them a payment link. Right, that'd be quite a cool way to use this. I just used it now to send someone an invoice. Just go to this link get it set up and just start using AI for, for pretty much everything now. So get used to it.